In this video, I'm going to show you how to VNC on Mac with the native screen sharing app. Now there is a app on Mac that comes built in called screen sharing, and we can use this to access a remote computer over VNC. Now, if you're not familiar, VNC, VNC stands for virtual network computing, and it allows you to use your mouse and keyboard here locally to control remotely a computer over the network or over the internet. So let me show you how to do that. I'm gonna assume that you have VNC credentials for a remote server somewhere. If you need to set up a remote server and control it via VNC, um, I have videos about that that you guys should check out. I, I don't know where I'm pointing, but um, at least at the end of this video, I'll show you how to do that. But for now, let me demonstrate with my credentials how this all works. So I'm gonna to go to the Spotlight search on my Mac and search for screen sharing. Okay, so that should be installed by default. And then we're gonna to connect to a host name or an Apple ID, but in our case, it's gonna be a host name and that is this entire IP address and port number. So we're gonna copy that. And by the way, this is a uh, an email from Contabo. That's kind of what I'm referencing. If you wanna set up a, uh, a GUI over the internet in the cloud, you can do it with them. So I'm gonna type that in, hit connect, and that is going to ask for a password. So my VNC password is right here. Very simple interface. We're gonna go ahead and sign in. And that should, maybe a prompt or two, nope, it brings us right to our uh, remote computer. This one is running Ubuntu 20.04. Looks like we have uh, updates for this. And actually this is, uh, if you're interested in this type of thing, this is a live, um, it's a live stream. 24 seven live stream on one of my channels. I'm just doing a test here. So let me see if I can find that swamp, swamp view YouTube. Uh, so this is, this is the computer that's, uh, this is what you're gonna see on the live stream. Um, and then let's go in here and let me show you what that looks like in real time. So this started streaming November 12th. Today is November 19th, so about a week ago. Oh gosh, the, the, uh, there's a loop of audio there. So basically, let me, uh, and I'm going way off topic here, but I think this is so interesting, this stuff. If I move this window, there's a delay, but you'll eventually see over here, <coughs> excuse me, in the live stream that my mouse actually brings that over. So that is exactly what we're looking at. If you are interested in doing something like that, I will point you to that video right here. As you can tell, I'm super pumped about it. Uh, so check that out next. I'll see you over there.